Hi there guys, welcome to Anthony Allen Edits, my name's Anthony Allen and the reason why I've got my daughter here today is because the subject that we're talking about, about is about education and also how YouTube has impacted uh, our lives beginning with education all the way down to where you're, you know, starting your jobs what you're doing for a living, wanting to go YouTube full time. Obviously YouTube has completely changed our society as it is as a whole. It's also gave us avenues in which we can earn money and earn a living. And me and Jack Cole, it's Jack Cole, another YouTuber, have touched upon this in a podcast called the Make Money Making Videos podcast. So you're about to see a snippet of that podcast where you're about to learn how we first encountered YouTube, back in the days when we were in school and also bouncing with ideas and scenarios of you know how this has impacted schools education and jobs of today mostly focusing on schools and education and the type of jobs that you can take and which are available to you and not being taught in schools so there's a lot about youtube and the online working environment that is not being taught in schools and that is one of the things that we will be talking about here in this video if this video has been helpful to you once you watch it all the way through then give us a thumbs up you know, that'd be really helpful and continued helps me to continue do what i'm doing and know also what you're interested in as well as sharing it with your friends and family as well so you can find Find, you know value and you can share it with others so without further ado let's get into the video and hope you enjoy it and subscribe for more videos like this please stand by the clip from the podcast is about to begin remember to like and subscribe to this video uh, we had um a min you remember mini clip when you had the yeah yeah of course Sonic. of course yeah it was flash sonic we were downloading flash sonic yeah and then putting it on the putting it in a in, in the document so the teacher couldn't see it. And yeah, then when yeah, the teacher yeah. turned back and we were supposed to be like, you know, and, and, and YouTube started to grow, so we started watching YouTube yeah. and you had the little do you remember the little maze that used to go around and then you had that scary face that come up? Yep, yeah, 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 the maze yeah, thing. It began with yeah. that with YouTube for us. Like yeah. that that was what we were watching and the maze would happen and you'd you'd get the scary face in your face. You know, yeah, for I some remember, reason. They used to do that as well. They, they started yeah. banning those in my school. Like for a while, for a while we, we, we had all those mini clip and yeah. uh, there was like those bloody stick figure games, like those stick guys, but it was uh yes. you know, they, stick like you blew them up and it was all bloody like that um and they started banning those they said no we got the ban hammer we we gotta stop these kids are these kids are just <laughs> around on the games all lesson we gotta get them off get but it's like it's like behind it as well yeah. yeah it's like behind it as well there's like an educational element to everything that we do online so with yeah. the uh for example momo um oh yeah it's going on yeah that's it yeah my kids have just had a letter from their teacher about momo it's a big thing right now be, 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 because of the YouTube uh, app where it's all, it's all going around or something like that. Yeah, so it's like they're, they're trying to educate them on, on, on protecting themselves online occasionally with letters like that yeah. when, it, when it explodes. So in a nutshell, if a video is to go viral or a trend is to go viral, everybody's paying attention to it. But with the normal yeah, everyday to. practices, there, there's a disconnect. You know, so, so unnoticed. Yeah, so unnoticed. And the thing is, there's kids sitting in school right now that don't know how to use a computer that they could, they could potentially be creating a career for themselves on the internet yeah, just go. like this and building a business for themselves on the internet just like this. But a lot of these people might literally just for a lack of being shown a different way have mm -hmm. to go into a conventional path of getting a job for somebody else and then maybe years later realizing like, holy there's all these opportunities on the internet. Why did nobody tell me about this stuff back when I was in a more multiple position to actually go after something like there this? There you go. There you go. And that's that's the main point with all that that like, we've just raised, like with yep. the Momo challenge and all that sort of stuff with the school and the education is is that it is that there's a disconnect and that's the reason why I'm telling you, Jack, what you're doing on YouTube is so mm -hmm. valuable to Thank to you, to growth in the future. Like Thank you, you. you've completely uh, like elevated my career alone, let alone what you're doing for other people, you know, that Thank aren't you, at the level that I'm at. So yeah. I commend you on what you're doing. Keep doing what you're doing, it's dope. It's 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 worthwhile. It's valuable, mm -hmm. and keep doing it. I'm gonna move on to the upwork things now. Thank you, um, bro. Let's do it. Yeah, because I've got a few more. Up, I've got quite a few questions that go into upwork. Uh, we've we've tackled a little bit of video editing. We've tackled videography, and then we've got some stuff with YouTube and YouTube growth that I want to tackle I as well. It. I love it. It's going great, man. Let's keep cracking on. We're